Eleven. Yes, Kindly retrieve one gold token. Thank you. A super congratulations to Soma, Venita, and Ilebaye as they came first, second, and third, respectively. Omano Bismoti know the arena game, they actually did absolutely well, guys. But which kind of arena game be this one? Like, I was just like laughing out loud because I didn't even know that the female would stand a chance not to talk of two female winning during this game i'm like away these are our female competitors they are very very strong and they are really focused on the game why i was even scared that most of the women are not going to win guys elebaye and venita decided to show that gears power shouldn't be underestimated at all it was even the way big brother called elebaye to ask her if she had fun or more he was really really funny and hilarious your head of house did you have fun? Yes, we had fun! <laughs> Honestly, this was really, really funny to me. I was just cracked up with the way Big Brother said, Ilebaye, did you have fun? And Ilebaye said, yes, I have fun! <laughs> Guys, it was also funny and hilarious. Anyways, congratulations to Soma, Venita, and Ilebayo once again because they actually added my expectation. I was even thinking that Pere, Soma, and Cross were going to be the fastest respectively, but the female decided to add my expectation. I was just like, oh, wow, these females, they are not just playing at all. Like, they are really in for the game and they are willing to do whatsoever man can do in that house. And they are showing that the female strength, the female power shouldn't even, the gear power as they used to call it in the house, shouldn't be underestimated or underrated. Moving forward guys, we are in for another interesting, amazing gist which I know you wouldn't want to miss out from any part of it because guys, CC was in a full operation mode, no be small operational. You no, know, some of her operation used to be in the dream but today she decided to operate in real life and guys, it was really, really shocking to all of us. No be small thing, no guys, a whole lot of things happened and that is all i am going to be downloading to you in this particular video all you need to do do not skip out from any part subscribe to my channel click on the notification bell button and please do not forget to give this particular video a very big thumbs up so guys no be small thing no today we saw cc and cross at the dining area playing a game enjoying themselves and having fun while big brother was just serving them with good and nice music and cross go find trouble they text cc say a woman where they find beleno they wear pint sleep now so cc contact cross say she no wear pint for dear and she won't get belen for cross i was just like hey wait guys no be smart you know why i was seriously laughing that was how cc still went for that to tell cross that see you i want to have your children i'm like uh uh i don't mind carrying your babies no i have a book as you know thank you i want to i want to give it to crazy motherfuckers like you like you can yeah i must you can get no, like guys this really cracked me up so bad like i don't want to use the f word and say it the way cc said it like when cc said she does not mind giving birth to cross children guys the way cross quickly changed it and said like ek i thought you said like ek i was just like cross cross the boss and she said ha ek hmm. and the way she just said that ek i was just like uh-uh but ek was your friend very good friend happy we were even shipping you and ek when ek was in the house this is what you are saying ek like someone that you wouldn't want to consider in that house to have children for i'm like okay well, I will not even say anything. I'm not even going to dwell too much on that. It is just a joke. It is just two of them flirting with... Okay, it was CC flirting and operating with Cross. And guys, CC decided to now give us the highest highlight of the day. Now, so CC decided to go and bring down Neo's picture that was up. Like the way she carried her chair to bring down Neo's picture. And she was just looking for biro, marker or pen to use to write something on Neo's picture after kissing it several times guys i was just like away this operation this operation that cc is operating in real life today um we are happy to see it too i'd not just like the fact that she would just go and operate in the dream and she would just be telling us in real life but i was also wondering why is it that she did not show this amount of love to know why he was still in the house now that he is evicted from the house she is now operating with neo's picture and the way she is now operating with her picture no be small one at all like the way she kissed the picture several times after looking for the biro and she saw one marker there she decided to go and write on the frame i miss you and she wrote cc i said 
Okay, oh, was it the reason why you guys had that kissing that night that Perry and Alice had that serious altercation? And guys, I strongly believe that if Neo were still in that house up to now, Omo, there would have been a sparkling situation between those two. And I would have loved to see how it would have panned out now that T-Badge and the Ure are no longer in the house. Guys, try. Oh my god, it really paid me that. Neo is now out of the house because I wanted to see the dynamics of that situation ship honestly and thank god that our sister CC is now beginning to operate in real life no longer in the dream as she used to operate moving forward guys not be small thing no Ilebaye is very very concerned to see that they actually win this week wager as she have to gather all the housemates to tell them about the wager for them to start preparing the wager again and guys to my greatest surprise and astonishment I had CC who have not really been very very active in this wager task telling Ilebaye that if it is the wager task that you want to talk about again please just leave us so we want to rest we want to rest not every time wager task wager task all work no play make Jack a dog boy <laughs> Guys, the way Auntie Missy was just speaking as though she had been really working on this wager or be actively involved in working on this wager. I'm like, what did they happen? She was just like, all work, no play, make someone a dog person, this one and that one, blah, blah, blah. In fact, Elebaye just told her that, see, it is not what I am coming to talk about. And she was just paying attention to listening to what Big Brother have told Elebaye, which she is going to tell them. And when Elebaye had gathered all of them and we are telling them about the wager again if you see the look on cc and cross face as they were not even ready to go back to work and start doing that wager something something again and eleven was just telling them see if you all are waiting for big brother to bring in another supply big brother is not going to bring in any other supply let them find a way and see how they are going to finish up those things that they were constructing then tomorrow they will know that they are just rehearsing on the presentation and cross was just telling her that see there is no longer glue for them to work with that they are waiting for big brother to bring in another glue so that they will use it to gum up all those things that they were constructing that for now or until big brother bring in the glue that they are going to put the work on hold and since she have told them and they were not taking it serious she decided to join them and start playing game of card with them and the other housemates who came out to find out why Elebayo was summoning them decided to go back to their bases and guys seriously I am here wondering and thinking how these people are actually going to win this their wager and guys I don't understand though because with hmm, will I now blame it on big brother or should I even blame it on the housemate but whichever one let's see how it is going to play out this will be ending this particular video